Oh. First of all, please tell me your name. Janae Brown. Janae. It's good to meet you. And you said your mama sent you, right? My mom sent me. That's a good Yes. And she, um, we're moving to Florida. Okay. So um, once we get there, we'll get the baby. We just want to pick them up and all the things here. Pick them out of it and all the things here. Now, we can get them shipped there. Okay. I believe I remember her telling you that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, first things first, I know she sent you to me because she trusts me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's a privilege for me, so I do want to make sure I get it right with your product too. Um, so we'll add hers whenever she reaches us back to remind me exactly what we had. Okay. Um, secondly, whenever people come shop with us, even though mom got what she wanted, their bodies are different. Yes. All right. And the last time you shopped for a bed was when? I think like 2017. No, you know what? It might have been when I got my time down. So maybe like 2015. Okay. A mini. So it's been a while. Yeah, and my mattress, okay. I've heard it's supposed to be like every eight years. I think yeah. we have exceeded that. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, that's the good part about it is your, mat your mattress was durable. Mm -hmm. So it lasted you in just enough time. Mm -hmm. So today, I do want to go over a process. So even though you had a bed before, I tell people our bodies are different and our situations are different. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. And so today when we took out a mattress, the whole point of us doing that, because it sounds like this is a master bed for you, yeah. mm -hmm. um, is to also make sure that you're able to keep that bed for as long as you need to, as well as, um, I call it solution-based recommendations. Mm -hmm. What's going on with your body? What are your needs? So you want to tell me a little bit about what, you, what you're needing a bed for? Uh -huh. So I recently had surgery, so uh -huh. I'm not quite sure. My sleeping habits have changed. So I used to sleep on my side. I used to just curl up with my body pillow or with mm. my man. But now, <laughs> you still no, Amen. 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 But now it. we kind of feel like a pregnant person oh, wow. um, because I had to have a lot of surgery in my abdominal area. Mm. And so from that, there's like pulling in tension or pressure. So in the hospital, I was incredibly uncomfortable. I was there for like three months. And so the bed is just not comfortable, right. right? Naturally. And then going through all that. So I had to always sleep with my legs elevated because it was like pulling um, like tension pulling a little bit from all the incisions. Now I don't have that pulling feeling okay. but sometimes I feel pressure my legs aren't elevated okay. so I have like my body pillow at the foot of my bed and then I have other pillows that kind of like make a body pillow for okay. me um, because I also um, like can feel it in my lower back a little bit mm. when I'm sleeping so I always have a pillow there Perfect. and then I will, if I'm laying on my side Okay. And then if I'm laying on my back, I'm fine. Okay. Um, but I would definitely have my legs elevated with that body pillow. Okay. Mm -hmm. right. That was great for you to tell me that. I grabbed my little note, okay. my little computer, because we do something that is called a sleep profile. Okay. And we do something called Dream World. And what that does is basically all the information you're feeding me, we're going to actually put that in a database. Okay. Because what it does, instead of us laying on 50 options today, it's also going to help me with my expertise of being a sleep expert for a long time. It's going to help me to narrow down the products to like maybe three to six beds. Okay. Based on your needs. So while we are going through the process today, we're going to fit you for a bed okay. like you get fit for a dress. Yeah. And how that looks is that we're going to lay on three options. Okay. Those three options are going to tell me if your body now versus then is going to like a softer feel, medium, or firm. Okay. okay? Next, but uh, before we start to lay, there is a sale that is on everything in this store. Okay. So on this side of the room, I call it the C-shaped side. Okay. <laughs> this is where you're gonna save up to five hundred dollars on select mattresses in the store. And as we were talking about the elevation of the feet, mm -hmm. we'll get into some things where we actually have a free head up adjustable base with the purchase of your mattress. Okay. Because we need the feet for you, we're actually gonna uh, commit that coupon for the free one to the upgraded base at least to get your feet. Oh, thank you. So you'll still get the savings on thank that. You, on that side of the room, I call it the VIP side. Okay. So this is where we're <laughs> going to find the best night's sleep of our life, the most doctor recommended. You mentioned some things about some surgeries and things that you have going on. Most doctors will recommend one of the brands on the other side of the room for okay. a guest like yourself. Okay. Last but not least, before we get started, to take that brain fog away of how much is this going to cost me to find a new mattress, mm -hmm. we actually have 0% interest options in our store. So if you find some, something in the store that you love, I know moving can be expensive yeah. and also an investment when you buy a new bed. Mm -hmm. So you can use our money because we got a, a budget for everybody okay. and a bed for everybody. Awesome. Okay. Um, your second option is a no credit needed option. Mm -hmm. 
So if you don't want your credit to be looked at, you can also opt into that, and they'll give we we will give you ninety days without interest on that. Okay, awesome. All right, so we'll get to that when when we got across the bridge. But let's start with us. I start later. And I know it was hard for you to ask me answer my question about what kind of sleep you are. But right now, outside of the surgeries, are you waking up looking at the ceiling? You on your side? How are you typically? I'm waking up on my side. Perfect. All right. So 80 percent of us are high five side sleepers. <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> I sleep on my side too. Yeah. And here's why that's important. Because even this here is a bed for your head. Okay. So 25% of your sleep surface is going to be a pillow. Mm -hmm. All right? Because I can put you on the right surface, but if the wrong thing is underneath your neck, it's too low, too high, it'll yeah. throw your alignment. Because I do have, like, tension mm -hmm. on my neck and shoulders. Mm -hmm. I don't ever feel like it needs to be elevated because I can do without a pillow okay. on my head. I need okay. a pillow more for, like, my body. Okay. But I'm going to take the pillow for my head. We're going to equally show you how important that is today. Yep. Okay. Because these are not regular pillows like from Walmart. Love Walmart like I do. But <laughs> the, what's in, the ingredients inside the bed is going to be some of the same materials that are going to give you some spinal support. Because I also heard you talking about those health issues, pulling and tugging. And sometimes it's the small nerves in our neck, yeah. things like that, that allow us not to sleep. And I have a smooth Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like a, a contour? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That I got from Mattress Firm years ago. Ooh. How did that work for you? It's uh, fine. Okay. I just think a lot of things just don't work anymore. Like okay. That was in 2015, 16. I got the pillows and the mattress, but now I just don't think, you know, life has changed. I'm going to show you how sometimes your pillow does matter, but I'm going to also show you how most of the things you express to me are going to actually have solutions when it comes to your foundation. Okay. All right, so hop on. I want you to lay on your side for me. Okay. And you do not have to take your shoes off unless you want to. Yeah. And I'm going to give you a little <laughs> thing for it because I know we got our little cute little dress on today. <laughs> and you could tell I used to be an usher in church, can't you? <laughs> Praise <laughs> Lord. Amen. Hey, me too. Hey. You see how I got in the bed <laughs> like this? Where's my church shawl? You're cute, shawl? mother. You're cute. <laughs> Where's no, my I church just want shawl? you to be comfortable as we lay. <laughs> So, the so, church shawl. Look, I do this with every single day. It might just be like, this is so crazy. But we want you to enjoy the experience, okay? So, Thank you. so no worries. So, the first things first, I'm going to put up some, some basic information here for us. And based on our conversation already, we want to make sure that we are catering the bed to your needs. And I am so sorry to hear about your surgeries and all that stuff. That can be a lot. And then we want to make sure that we're actually catering the bed to help you recover. Uh -huh. Because even though, you know, those surgeries have been a little bit, but as women, I've also dealt with fibroids before. And I'm also an athlete, and I work out. So those type of things, those women issues, things like that, we definitely still have the option to um, hire body repairs based on our sleep. Absolutely. Okay, so as a sleep expert, I always educate my customers like that. Yeah, and I let them know that something that they feel like may not matter to me, everything matters. So don't be afraid to talk to me about these things because it's gonna help me to help you better. Perfect. Okay. Right now we're laying on Goldilocks. Okay. I call her Goldilocks because she's medium, not too firm, not too soft. And I love that you're laying on your side right now. Okay. One of the things that we'll share uh, a little bit later is you told me sometimes you end up like a rotisserie chicken. You turn to turn and you end up in different positions. Okay. Sometimes that's an indication of your mattress not working with your body. Yeah. Yeah. So we need to focus on something that's called pressure relief. Mm -hmm. And so and when we're on top of certain beds, you're going to feel less of that tugging on your hips and shoulders, mm -hmm. which ultimately at night causes you not to toss and turn so much so you can go into room sleep and your body can repair more. Mm -hmm. All right? How are we done here? You ready to go to the next one and compare it? That's gross. And you can do shoes, you can leave them in the Okay, thank you. <laughs> Bring your pillow with you though. That's your boyfriend. What's your boyfriend name? Chris. We're going to, oh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> Come on, take him on this experience with us. Okay. We're going to take Chris along so he can agree to. So when y'all cuddling, he can be comfortable too. <laughs> I don't even know we're doing this. I love it. He's going to like this, sir. That's it. <laughs> Okay, so sweetheart. So now we're on firm. We're gonna compare our firm to our medium. 
And sometimes I always give the rule of thumb to like maybe a minute or two. Wherever you're ready to go to the next one, if your body know it, I don't like it, we don't have to stay on it long. I, no? I have the same comment for both of them. It's, okay. it's not, I don't think it's the, the texture, not that's not the word, the, it's not that it's firm or plush. I just think that <laughs> my grandfather calls me, um, a sweet pea from Princess of the Pea. It's gonna take me a long time, like Princess of the Pea, to get comfortable. Okay. And so, like, I want to like put something on my lower back, regardless okay. of the bed. Okay. So that's why, like, I don't think it's the bed. I think it's like my back. Okay. So this, we're gonna do this because uh -huh. I feel like this is very important for me to say. Uh huh. We are going to explore how to make your back feel better in a second. Okay. Okay. But I don't want to start introducing basics too quick. Because okay. I don't want you to fall in love with the bed based on the adjustment. Gotcha. Okay. So to our best, I want to make sure that we at least rule out one or two of these things. I like that one more than this one. We all we all know. <laughs> Come on, let's roll. And I kind of knew you were gonna say that. But yeah. as a side seat, because we don't like nothing pushing up I against like us too much. Yep. There you go. Question. I knew it. And I always <laughs> ask people this golden question. If I was to give you one of these beds free today, which one would you choose? I would choose a, something between plush and firm, like whatever that middle is. Okay. That's what my natural go to would be, like okay. from words. Gotcha. So we're gonna we're gonna check that out in a second. So now we're on plush. Don't don't judge it until you lay on. All right, because sometimes people say, "Fifty, I like this," and they walk out with something totally different once they lay on. And so the plush is gonna give us a little bit more pressure relief. All of these bits that we laid on have the same support at the bottom of the bed. Okay? I'm missing. I like this one the most. Okay. But there is a Okay. Um, so you like the feel of this one, but if it was up to you to see just a little bit less. Yes. I got you. Yes, okay. So you like this one bit. So I want to do one thing just to, to make sure that I'm correct. Okay. We know this is your first choice so far, but sometimes when we're in between, oh, that one was okay, but I like that one. I like to rule out at least one. So we're going to rule out firm, but I want you to do one more time because we're freshly getting off this one. We go back to medium for me right now. Okay. Sometimes when your body lays on it more than once, your body starts to tell the difference. Watch it feel different now, when it, now that you're going there. So whether it's good or bad, that's what we need to know. Church. Ah uh, yes. <laughs> come on, come on, she. <laughs> I love it. All right. But I know that little sheet make you feel like you're at home too, like your little cover sign. Mm -hmm. Girl, it ain't nothing like when you get off under them covers at home. What you was about to say? Like this is cool. Like there's nothing wrong with that. I can but you still. Perfect. So it is because you turned on the adjustable. <laughs> you trying to have fun already? <laughs> Not the shaking of it. You coming back? <laughs> I'm sorry. And then you put the zero gravity thing. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's gonna stop in a second. Okay. Um. Yeah, that one is a softer. Um, but this one doesn't sink. Correct. So that's why I was just like, I like. Oh my God! You them definitely for different reasons. Look, you definitely put on the zero gravity because it's about to fold us. <laughs> <laughs> this was the fun part of the day. I didn't even mean. <laughs> Your feet trying to have fun already, Lord. That's okay. <laughs> no, I love that. <laughs> so you were saying that's still your fave. That I like that one because okay. it's softer, but I like this one because I'm not sinking. It tells me exactly where to take us. Okay. I have put in our sleep disruptors and everything in here. Okay. And yeah, let's go. So the tablet is definitely giving me some great recommendations. So we're gonna be plush, but watch what we're gonna experience. We're gonna go now to Tempur-Pedic, which is the number one brand of bed in the world. You're gonna feel more temperature because I'm pretty sure you sleep warm. You told me you toss and turn sometimes. Okay. Sometimes that comes from heat retention. You stick your foot out the blanket. Mm -hmm. Kind of cool side of the pillow? No. Okay. I tend to, I was telling Caleb that I get in bed freezing. Like my okay. feet are always cold. Okay. But by the middle of the night, I'm like, okay, I'm not cold no more. Okay. But my feet aren't sweating. It's okay. just like, I guess, that was all. I don't know. Okay. So we need to have something that's not cool, but temperature regulated. Okay. 
that's where we're going that because sense. that's important for going into what we call real sleep. Okay, yeah, yeah. all right. So, because you're supposed to sleep on a cool surface, Dr. Recommended, we're going to try this one. Okay. We're going to switch technologies. Before you lay, I always tell people this is why I need you to lay a little longer. Okay. Because it's the smart technology, and it's going to read your shape, your weight, and your temperature. Now, this is going to be plush as well. Plush and soft is the same. Okay, okay. But over there, now we're going to talk technology. Because now we've already eliminated medium and we've already eliminated firm. But here, when we're focusing on what is going to be the actual right bed for you, now we have to explore that is what we call a traditional pillow top. This is going to be more like 30% foam on the top. The rest is inner spring. The spring is what holds up the end of the bed. That's what your support is. That sinking that you say you don't want to feel, that's why you don't feel like you're sinking too bad over here. When you're over here, you are going to be a little bit more on top of the bed. That feels more like a cloud feel. This feels more like you're on top of the bed more so over there. This, um, I think that my body, like my thighs, No, that's okay. But like, I like to get in the bed and it's like an empty, like, oh my bed. Okay. And I had that with that one. You felt there. like that was better than the all tempered foam. Yeah, okay. I don't know. This reminds me of my mom's bed. And I don't know if it's the height. Yeah, it don't have, I need to feel like I'm on a cloud. I understand. Yeah. I know what I'm going to you this one. Okay. Okay, so we've tried traditional in a spring, 30% foam, rest is coil. This is all temper foams, and I do want to give you a disclaimer. Tempur-Pedic foams and memory foam is not the same. Okay. And I'm going to explain that to you in a second. Okay. But we're going to go to my baby. Here she go. Sorry, I, I move my bed around like three times. So, <laughs> so we're going to go here, and I just need you to trust me. Okay. Okay? Because I know that this says medium, but Tempur-Pedic, when you come to the Lux Adapt, so I still adapt to give you the soft feel, but you gotta trust me because you also said you like to feel like you're not sinking and you like support. So soft and support at the same time. This is gonna be a hybrid. So what that means, it gives you the feel of that bed over there, the black one you like, and that bed right there, having a baby. It's 50% temper foams, the rest is coil. When you add a little bit more foam to the bed, in the support levels at the bottom, you're gonna get the best of both support as well as pressure relief. Mm -hmm. Now, it's fine if you don't love it because that's why we're doing the process. But at least we know there are three technologies now. Hybrid, half and half, all foam, temper, foams, and then a traditional feel. You got three feels. I see your face. Okay. I think that's okay. I'm a um like okay. I need like the texture feeling. You want to feel hugged and supported at the same time. Mm -hmm. So this is the beauty in it, what we just did. We now know that the, the product that you like the most, the technology you like the most is traditional. Mm -hmm. Okay? If we don't go through this entire process, then we may risk not finding the right technology for you. Mm -hmm. So we have actually gotten a lot far right now. Okay. We okay. have eliminated 80% of the beds in this entire store <laughs> by what we just did. Okay. Does okay. that make sense? Mm -hmm. So now I'm, we're going to go back to about, about two more traditional fields. Okay. I'm going to put you on beds that hug you and feel traditional just like that. You ready to roll, Mama? Yeah. Let's go, Mama Sita. Bring Mr. Chris. Oh, oh, that oh, is okay. Leave that alone. You're messing nothing up. <laughs> it's okay. Chris was like, he agree with you. He ain't like that when he got. Yeah. <laughs> Of the body temperature that we talked about. 
most of the times when you go foam like that, you don't get uh, you don't get temper pumps in the bed and a traditional feel. This is both. You're gonna still feel like that, but on top of the surface, you're gonna feel a little bit more temperature and they do something called an IntelliCoil in this bed. What that simply means is they take a metal piece and they drop another piece in the middle of all of them. So over there when you were saying that you want to not sink so much, but you still like to be hugged, that coil is what helps us not to feel like we're sinking too bad. Okay. And then the pillow top is good for your hips and shoulders. So as you're laying in five to 10 hours into the night, you don't want the bed going, this is what's your joints all night, which ultimately helps us to, that pillow top helps us to feel hugged a little bit. Still like the black or this one? Okay. I love it. This is why it's important that we go back. I feel like I'm 
You know why? Because you've been on the softest mattress. Yeah. So this is exactly why I was saying in the beginning that it's important to go back because your body starts to execute one over the other. So, twin. I like this, and I like the one that Caleb told me about, and it was the one the on that firm high point left to it. You like the firm? No, it wasn't firm. It was hybrid. Wasn't it hybrid? Yeah, the that's firm. That's mm -hmm. the one that we just came off of. Not the one, but the one before. That's the one before, but to the left of it, we didn't get on it. That's a firm.